try that we've gotten to this milestone number. If you don't remember me, I'm the marketing director for Downtown Podcast, filling in for Susan, our co-host, who is sick today. We wish her well and hope she gets better soon. But tonight we have two awesome community members, Ryan Cormier and Chase Spillman. And before we get started, I'm going to have you guys do some rock, paper, scissors to go into this. Uh, All right. All right. You ready Let's for this? this. Uh, Let's go. All right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ah, All right, so you're a loser, but <laughs> you will pick. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Ouch. That's how we welcome people at the All podcast. Right. You're going to pick this uh, fortune okay. for uh, the whole downtown community, and this fortune cookie is going to snake starting from the back to the front of the audience, and you're going to do a little telephone where you whisper to the next person what you think the first person said about the fortune cookie. At the end of our episode, we'll compare the actual fortune to what's um, been thought to have been said regarding the fortune cookie. and. Jonathan here is going to come up and get our fortune. Hey, Jonathan. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. So we're going to start with Ryan. You recently moved here from Dallas. I did. And you open a digital marketing agency down here. But I brought you on the show to talk about Dumpster Fire Fantasy Football and interesting you names. You want yeah. to tell us about that and where that name originates from? Yeah. So Dumpster Fire is a fantasy football platform that a good friend and I built. Um, and it was an idea that, that originated as many great ideas do over a nice cold beer. Um, we got together nice. and we were just talking about fantasy football. We're huge fantasy football lovers, and you know we just kind of, kind of got to thinking, like, why do we always play with ESPN or CBS or Yahoo? And then we realized there just really isn't anything, what we thought, better out there. And so, right. you know, after several beers, we decided we're going to build something better. And the name Dumpster Fire comes from, if you're an Urban Dictionary fan, it's it's you know a complete and utter disaster. It's something <laughs> nobody wants to deal with. So, if you have a horrible car that's always breaking down. God, my car is such a dumpster fire, and <laughs> and so as kind of a fun play on the name, we we as a way of shaming the last place team in every league uh, that whoever comes in last gets a nice little dumpster fire trophy in their trophy case on their profile, um, right. just as a memory of that that horrible season. Because you're such a great friend, you want to shame the losers. Absolutely. Right? <laughs> you mentioned that you found some shortcomings in the CBS and the Yahoo uh, fantasy football platforms. Yeah. Let us know what is different about yours and what you decided to offer. Yeah. Well, the thing about I mean CBS, Yahoo. Yeah. ESPN, they're all great, uh, but they're news organizations, and, and their primary goal is to sell content and sell advertising, and we wanted to be different. So when we built Dumpster Fire, our number one goal was to focus on the game and the experience of playing fantasy football, because that's what it's really all about, right? It's, it's an experience right. with your friends and family, coworkers, whatever. So we cut out all of the content. We minimize the advertising. We don't have full screen takeovers right. and video ads like they do. Um, and we're not trying to fulfill a, a big corporate agenda. We're just trying to create something that, that will allow people to have fun doing something that they already love. Um, and so we really just focused on a, a sexy, elegant design, really nice user interface, and, and again, a product that will allow people to have a lot of fun when they're playing fantasy football. Right. So actually, football season is not that far away. But you said that in the past you've just done beta testing with your friends, but this year, this season, you're going to be opening it up to the public, right? Absolutely. So if people want to go join your fantasy football platform and reach out to you, where can they reach you? Yeah, that's a great question. So if anybody interested, you can check out the site. It's dumpsterfire.com. Um, you can go on social media. We're at dumpsterfireff on Twitter. Um, hit us up. We're very responsive. We'll get back to you. If you have any questions, I'm at Ryan J. Cormier on Twitter. Hit me up. I'll, I'll get back with you. And uh, we would love for you guys to check it out. It's, it's a cool platform. We're excited. Thanks so much. I've never played, but I will try it out this time. And I'll tell you what I think about it. Awesome.